All right, YouTube, what's up? Today we are putting on a TRD Pro grill onto my buddy's 2017 TRD Off-Road Tacoma. Super simple install. All you gotta do is have a flathead and a Phillips screwdriver. Then you use the Phillips on this one and that one. And then you just need the flathead to pop up that, that guy, and then under the grill, under this plastic, there's four. One, two, three, and four. And then what you do after that is you just pull the grill off and reinstall the new one. So we'll show you guys step by step how we do it. We got this grill on Amazon and it's genuine Toyota parts. It was 380 to 390 and uh, which is way cheaper than the dealerships because I know the dealerships are anywhere from like four to 500 depending on your dealership. And it's a very easy install. So I'll leave the link for all this stuff uh, down in the description. And we also have black lettering that we're going to be putting on the back of this uh, Toyota. So now we have this one off, these two, that one over there, and then all four underneath. So then you should just be able to pop the grill off just by pulling it, so. <laughs> oh, I didn't know that came Alright, so once you have the grill off, there's these tiny little screws that you need to unscrew. It's like 10, 15, something like that, but they're all down here. So you can just see them. Just unscrew all of them. And then the silver tabs right here, just pop this uh, silver bumper off. Obviously, put a towel down or something down so you guys don't scratch it up. Even though you are putting a new one on, but you could potentially resell this. Right, so once you have all the screws out, you're gonna start hitting down these uh, chrome tabs. And the easiest way to see which ones it is, is just lift up your grill, and you can kind of see which uh, chrome tabs go out, as opposed to the black that's gonna stay on the grill. Yeah, so and you want to take all these black ones off because that's for the actual grill itself. So there's a lot of tabs, just be careful. Basically, you're going to take all the tabs from the back off, except for these ones, because these are what actually holds in your paint colored uh, part of your grill. All right, so now that, uh, make sure all of your tabs are popped through. Pretty much just working in reverse now, and then just put in all your uh, screws. Make sure everything's tight. So, you're gonna have some extra screws. It's uh, different because this is one complete piece, and that's two pieces. So, don't be alarmed if you have extra screws. Just make sure you put them back in. I don't really know why you need to take all these screws out. I think it's just in case you need to finagle the uh, white part of the uh, grill. But now the next step is to put it back on the truck. All right, there it is, fully installed. Looks freaking good. Definitely a, a bold appearance. So. If you guys are wanting to do this to your vehicle, I'll leave the link down in the uh, description. Got this freaking crane over here. Oh, I can't wait to have my house. Anyways, so I'll leave a link in the description for you guys and uh, you can pick it up. We're gonna do the stickers in the back. It's stickers, it's self-explanatory, but I'll leave the uh, link for those in the description as well. If you like this video, uh, leave a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give me a thumbs down. Let me know what I could do to make it better. And uh, subscribe if you want more Toyota content for modifications, off-roading, and info. All right, thanks guys.